11? 11. 11 of Japan 2.0 and today we are kind of going around Shibuya again and Harajuku because we are finishing our souvenir shopping which I have laid out on the bed right there because we've done all the shopping that we really want to do there's a little bit more that I want to do in Harajuku so we'll probably sneak over there but we are doing souvenir shopping I have got stuff for friends and I'll do a proper layout in tomorrow's video probably but yeah, that is the plan today, and here's the outfit of the day. So I have this top that I got from WC, shorts I got from Forever 21, and I'm wearing the Fila shoes again because they're really comfortable. So we're gonna go. time but I'm so excited still. All right, it's souvenir time. What are we starting off with? Bug gachapons, love that. So we started off by going to Harajuku and right when you enter Harajuku from the station, there's this little side street and I guess it's titled Le Ponte, Le, Le Pump. Anyways, and it's super cool and it's got a bunch of like Japanese themed shirts, goodies, knickknacks, literally the tourist like this is the souvenir spot to be they had pins they had magnets they had keychains they have everything that you could possibly want souvenir wise some of it was a little expensive but some of it was actually pretty affordable and we did end up getting my dad a cool samurai hat from here which i thought was really cool and he did love it when we got home he loved it a lot and we picked up my brother a shirt as well and my mom got her co-workers a few souvenirs from here as well but some of it yeah it, it was a little pricey but if you want some freaking cool souvenirs i definitely recommend going down this street the shirts were really really cool like definitely a good representation of Japan unless you want like an anime titty waifu booby shirt then I mean like you do you we also down the little area in a little bit there's a little in circle-y part and they have little stores full of like candy snacks and cute little toys and knickknacks which I thought was really cool so we went and saw that for a little bit then we headed back out to the main street to head to we go as I wanted to just peek in there once more and of course we love we go I love we go it's I don't know if it's like discounted probably not it's like pretty regular price but it's like a decent priced for fashion which is one thing that I love as I feel like a lot of fashion is expensive over here or at least I'm buying it online anyways look at some socks we love socks socks are really good but the reason why i went back into wego was to debate whether i wanted to get one of these eat a bag purses which i didn't end up doing and kind of regret as they were super super cute and i feel like they're super trendy right now but oh well maybe i can find one online that's super cute next we headed to daiso as they also had a little section area full of like souvenir type-esque things and we actually ended up getting those cat ones right there for co-workers and staff from my mom and myself which just were really really cute I also got these little bags I got some Hello Kitty ones little twin star and the my melody ones to put all the goodies for my staff and friends in so that was our cute little Daiso haul plus it was affordable if you want affordable haul I recommend Daiso and you know, of course, your girl couldn't go down Harajuku without popping into the shoe store. And yes, yes, I, I bought more shoes once again on this little shoe adventure. How could you not, though? Have you seen the shoes that they have in Japan? I mean, look, look at those yellow stompers. One that I wish I had gotten for my pom pom purin hashtag look. But they've got rainbow. They, they're all like platforms as well. I feel like that's because they're, you know, short. They want to be a little taller. But when we were there, they had these really cool new platforms in, and I'm talking about those sparkly boys. Yes, those ones up in the corner. Your girl purchased those along with the same pair of shoes that I have in purple. Heading down the street, we popped into Body Line. This is on the balcony of Body Line. You're not allowed to film in there, but I filmed coming out as we kept walking down the street as I got a nice view of the people. These socks came out right as we were leaving and I regret so much not buying one of every of them because they're so flipping cute and pastel 
and then we started to head back those in the afternoon back to Shibuya like 109 like the Shibuya crosswalk that famous little area as we were gonna pop into Shibuya there was a few things that I wanted to snatch up last minute from the Sanrio store because I am obsessed Sanrio is like so cute and so perfect. I love them so much and Hello Kitty and Pom Pom Perrin, my boy. There was just a few little things like some hair ties and lip glosses that I wanted to pick up from friends and for myself. And of course I popped into the Wego here as well just to pick up, I think it was a belt. Uh, one of the neat things though that we noticed leaving or like closer to the end of our time to Japan is that the staircase in Shibuya 109 had these really cool like decorations on like every second floor. So every second floor had these like really really elaborate like Instagram aesthetic backgrounds along with rainbow stairs. Hi, how are you? That's amazing and I love that. So I'm not sure if it was for like some sort of like ad or something but it was freaking cool nonetheless and I enjoyed taking pictures in front of them. Then we decided it was time to head back and get some dinner and relax in our Airbnb so that is where we are going right now. Alright guys, we are back at the Airbnb for the second time today. We came back, kind of collected where we were at, and then we went out again. And we got our free little cups from Daiso because we were collecting stamps and we got free mugs, kind of. We still had to pay like three extra dollars, but it was fine and they're really cute. But I have got all my souvenirs laid out and I got them all. I'll probably put the haul of the souvenirs in a haul video when I'm back, but let's go over it briefly, shall we? So I have things for my friends, I've got stuff for my coworkers here, and then I have things for family, and we've got like little snacks, and everyone gets these like little candies, because I got these last time we were in Japan, and they were really good, so everyone's getting some of those. And then, yeah, I've got stickers, these stickers are for myself, but yeah. Souvenir day is done. All right guys. Well, I love you guys a lot We are gonna have dinner and then we are gonna have to figure out how to put all of that in four suitcases tomorrow That's tomorrow's video. I'm excited. I kind of like Tetris and it's gonna be a good day. So yeah I love you guys a lot and I'll see you tomorrow.